Road to GH will reveal intriguing developments on Wednesday, December 4, 2024. First, after learning that Drew had officially betrayed him by trying to oust Curtis from the position of CEO of Aurora, Curtis felt deeply disappointed and disillusioned. In his confusion, he turned to Jordan, hoping to receive advice from her. With her experience and understanding, Jordan didn't hesitate to offer Curtis sincere advice. She urged him to stay clear-headed and reassess his professional relationship with Michael, as well as the growing rift with Drew. Jordan emphasized that while Curtis might feel betrayed, he should not allow personal emotions to overshadow his professional decisions. She encouraged him to find a way to restore trust and professionalism in his relationship with Michael and to stand firm in the face of challenges ahead. Second, when Lulu woke up from her coma and realized she was no longer in the world she once knew, a sense of confusion and disorientation flooded her mind. After fleeing and being found by the Spencer family, she had hoped to return to the peaceful days she once enjoyed, but the reality was far different. Everything had changed during the four years she had been missing. Her mother, Laura, with eyes full of sorrow, recounted the entire story, shattering Lulu's heart. She could hardly believe that her beloved father, Luke, had passed away. All the memories of past days, of the dreamlike adventures of their family, now only existed in the past. A sense of loneliness and loss overwhelmed Lulu as she heard that her sister, Charlotte, had disappeared with Valentine, someone she had never truly gotten to know. The only thing that remained clear in her mind was the emptiness, as she realized that her dearest loved ones were no longer by her side. Every detail of the deaths of those she loved, Charlotte's disappearance, and Sam's sacrifice was too much for Lulu to bear. She felt like an outsider, no longer belonging to this world, as everything she had known was now shattered and completely changed. The feeling of being left alone in a new, painful world made Lulu unsure of what to do, as before her lay a dark future full of irreplaceable losses. Third, when Anna learned that Lulu had woken up and had to face the ultimate pain upon hearing that her daughter, Charlotte, was missing, Anna was filled with guilt and remorse. She couldn't shake the feeling of self-blame as it was she who had given Valentine the opportunity to escape. Anna remembered the tense days when she decided to help Valentine flee, a decision that now, looking back, she could not forgive herself for. With a new perspective, Anna felt that the separation Charlotte had to endure was even more painful than anything she could have imagined. The young girl not only had to be apart from her family, but also from her mother, Lulu, who, before going missing, had always been a loving and caring mother. Charlotte now had to live in the shadow of an uncertain life, alongside a man whom everyone knew to be a criminal. And during all this time, Anna could do nothing to remedy the situation, only stand by and watch the pain of Lulu and the irreversible loss. Finally, when Rick decided to confess everything to Ava, he could no longer hide the truth. In a moment of honesty, he told Ava why he had sided with her in the battle against Christina. Rick's support for Ava wasn't just for personal gain or a business relationship. He admitted that, for a long time, he had felt a special connection with her, a bond he couldn't deny. He acknowledged that his actions toward Ava had not been solely out of duty or calculation, but because of genuine feelings. Rick's words left Ava completely surprised. She had never imagined that Rick felt this way about her, as their relationship had always been filled with schemes and secrecy. Ava understood that, in order to win against Christina in court, she needed solid support and strategy, and Rick was the one who could help her achieve that. With Rick's heartfelt confession, Ava knew she could trust him more than ever before.